Welcome back. Joining us live here in Las Vegas as we see the number one seed straight ripping two over Instinct One. Now, we heard earlier in that match, at the, actually at the end of the match, Snipe Down saying, you know, I want to finish this. I want to finish this out. What does that go to show about their determination, what they, their mindset for this tournament? Well, I think, you know, it's an opportunity to kind of make a statement. You put the controllers down and, and, and maybe you don't, you know, get to make that statement. I think right now what Instinct needs to do is they've really got it. They got their backs against the wall. And one of the things we've seen in them is they never say quit. They got to come up with the game in their lifetimes right here or else they're done. They got to fight from the lower bracket. All right. As we get ready now for game number four, straight ripping and Instinct. That's right, it's winner's bracket round two. Game four of the best of five series. If Straight Ripon wins this one, they will advance to the winner's bracket finals. If Instinct wins this one, we are going to game five, a deciding team slayer. And man, I'm excited for this matchup. We saw in Toronto, King of the Hill on construct. Straight Ripon won that one, and they held Soviet to only eight kills that time. He's gonna look for a bit of revenge, and we're kicking this one off with All Might Warrior from Straight Ripon. And you know what, I'm going to say this, I'm going to call it right now. You see a good start for Instinct, obviously with three members of Straight Ripping Down, but I, I'm watching for Snipe Down. I'm watching for Snipe Down to do things on this map. He has a history of going off on this map. He really knows the angles. He's able to put shots on you from all kinds of crazy places I didn't know were even possible. And you know, the last time these guys went up uh, against each other on this map, he was 39 and 21. So he's going to be their slayer. I don't expect to see him in the hill very much. And of course, Snipe Down, he's got a few videos up on the game oh, yeah. room of him playing <laughs> on this map. Just sitting up top, raining down fire on everyone. But right now, we're checking out as Lunchbox. He's rocking out these rockets here. Went all the way from top of gold, oh. went down and went up open. Now takes the sword spawn. And he's going to do a great job of clearing all the straight ripping out of the hill. Elmite oh, Warrior, the last member of the trying to do some damage from down low. And T-Squared is going to help him out. That's a great job by Elamite right there, staying alive and allowing his teammate to come and help him. That's a huge play. I like that bucket. Rocking Rockets. Tweet. Tweet. Ooh, <laughs> right. Rockets. Now you're just dating yourself. <laughs> I don't, I've never heard that song. That's because you're 12. <laughs> All right. <laughs> anyway. Roy doing some dirty. Picking up a big kill on two legit. We're going to jump on board with his twin brother. It's Lunchbox. He's coming up through the basement. And in fact, he's going to actually move up top. 30 seconds left on this bottom hill. He's going to go to the sword spawn, or at least try and clear straight ripping out oh. of that sword spawn. But T squared VR is just going to be too much. I want to jump on board with the player you were talking about, Sundance. The last time they met up, Snipe Down put up 39 kills. Let's see how many he can get this time around. 13 minutes left on the clock, and of course, just like Oddball, here in King of the Hill, the first team to 250 seconds will win. Back goal, back goal. Behind goal, one shot, behind goal, one shot. Watch the purples, keep watching purples. Watch blue ramp, watch blue ramp. I said kill from over purple. Let's go purples, see you guys. One sound, you got, you got help, Eric. You got help. I, I, I thought it was him, man. Oh. Well, he's one shot. One shot on purple. One shot on purple. You got me. Nice, he's dead, he's dead. Blue ramp was big, Walshy. Walshy, Walshy. Going up open right now. Lifting up open right now. Good hell, it's hurt, Soviet. All right. Come on, come on, come on. We have to get out of here. Two, open, open shit, open shit, open shit, one top shot, goal, one goal. shot, open shit, gold. Walsh, Walsh was one shot. We gotta get up top, we gotta get up top. I'm gonna go up close. close, go up You're close. You're gonna hit two of them, you're hitting two of them. Yeah, we kind of weak in hell, one's open three. Rockets up, rockets up. Wait, 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 Eric, wait. Let's just strike them first. Up close. I'm coming top right now. One shot, C3, one shot, left side, in Roy, in lobby, Roy. O3, O3. Roy was weak in lobby, one shot, O2. They have rocks, they have rocks. How many dead? Where's Roy, where's one Roy? Dead. Open street, open street. street. Watch Rockets one shot over purple. Rockets one shot over purple. R1 Roy. One shot he got me. Open three. Open three with rocks. Open three with rocks. Going. He's in hell with rockets. Hurt. Two, two, three. 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 Two,
I got him. Top goal. Let's get the 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 there was another one sword. Watch Oh my warrior, oh, I gotta dirty. come back in on that one Sunday. That was just dirty. naughty. Dirty. Putting down lunchbox dirty. and then cleaning up with the headshot. Straight ripping, trailing by about 40 seconds here. Instinct doing a nice job of picking up big time on the top hill. But now straight ripping is gonna try and lock down the bottom hill with El Might Warrior watching from above here in the sword room. He's on a spree. You know, a lot of teams have a hard time with this bottom hill, and they kind of just they conceded to a certain degree. But it seems like straight ripping been being very aggressive on it now, knowing that they're down. Obviously, they, they need to get as much time as possible. But it's only 24 seconds. You know, and, and so when this hill moves, it's going to be a position. They're going to want to be in position. They're going to want to make sure they've got you know themselves in a spot where they can get a lot of time when it moves back up top. But I like what I'm seeing. I'm seeing them doing the slang, getting in the hill, and communicating. But oh, again, snipe down right now. He okay. is eating it up. Snipe down is starting to do some slaying. But what I really like from Instinct is they're getting three or four or five seconds at a time as snipe down repositioning himself. They're just running in that hill. That's going to add up. So right now, you got to you got to kind of like the way Instinct's going about it. They've got the lead and they're grabbing little bits of time. Straight ripping on the other hand is in a position where they need big bunch at the time. Oh! Two big no scopes there on the lunchbox, but snipe down is going to be taken out. He has nice hair. There you see Ace getting fired up. That's the coach of Stray Ripping. Hi, Megan. Hi, Amy. <laughs> Sundance knows all the girls in the audience. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> all right, here, and I want to get back in the action. We're going to jump on board with El My Warrior. Oh, we're going to Walsh instead. That's all right. He's shooting at El My Warrior. It's kind of I agree. Thing. Oh, well, she's taking it. Elmite won. I should have gone to Elmite. Look at this. Straight ripping. About to take the lead. Chicka chow. See, that's the thing about straight ripping. They just, I, you know, it looked like Instinct was in a position where they had a nice little lead. They just got to stick to their game plan. And then suddenly straight ripping just comes up and craps on that idea by grabbing big chunks of time. And the thing about it is, Again, I can't say it enough. When you have the level of ability that all four of these guys have, they can be any player at any given game. That's not to say that the four guys on this thing aren't amazing players, but you know what? We've seen it time and time again. These guys just are continuously stepping up. We're still waiting to see Soviet step up. He, he has moments of brilliance. There's no doubt about it. The twins are great, and you know what you're going to get out of wall sheet. But again, it's just it, it's it's the twins for instinct who seem to be leading the charge and having to do big things.